Okay, good afternoon class. Okay, this is our second day of online classes. Okay, so yesterday we have been discussed about the light. Okay, but before we go to our new discussion, I would like to have a recap about our uh, vocabulary uh, vocabulary last time. Okay, please repeat after me. Okay, I'll show you. Okay. Brain. Again. Brain. Light source. Light source. Visible. Visible. Energy. Energy. Brightness. Brightness. Light. Light. Lightning. Lightning. Luminous object. Luminous object. Non luminous object. Non luminous object. Okay, this our word, the word yesterday. Okay, so when we say luminous object, are objects that is natural. For example, the sun, okay, uh, the lightning, jellyfish, or fireflies are those uh, luminous objects or they are natural. What we say the non luminous object are the man made. Like, for example, a traffic light, a light, a light bulb. Okay, okay, these are the non luminous objects. But today, we discuss a new topic on how we care our, our eyes. Okay, because uh, eyes uh, is very important to our body parts. Okay, but before that, I would like to introduce to you our new vocabulary. Okay, we have a vocabulary. Okay, so the first vocabulary is staring. Again, this is the first vocabulary is staring. Again, staring. One more time, staring. Next, avoid, avoid. Avoid. Next word, I damage. I damage. Device. Device. Screen. Screen. Lamps, lamps. Television, television. Glaring, glaring. Sunlight, sunlight. Ice train, ice train. Okay, these are the new vocabularies that we can see. Sunglasses, sunglasses. Sunlight, sunlight. Glaring, glaring. Avoid. Avoid television, television, lamps, lamps, screen, screen, device, 
device. Eye damage. Eye damage. Staring. Staring. Eye strain. Eye strain. Improve, improve, and protect, protect. Okay, these are our new vocabularies that we can see in our textbook. Okay, next, let's proceed our new discussion. Okay, look at this. Okay, look at a picture. Okay, a man. What does a man wearing? Okay, a man is wearing a sunglasses. Why? Why some people are wearing sunglasses when they are exposing from outside or outside? Why? It's because it protects their eyes from sunlight. So, it's very important to wear a sunglasses while we are driving. Okay, some are driving a motorcycle driving a car, some of the people are wearing sunglasses to protect their eyes from the reflections of the sunlight. Okay, so our eyes are very important. Okay, we must care for our eyes. Okay, staring at a very bright object like the sun can cause eye damage. We must avoid looking at it. We can also use sunglasses to protect our eyes from the glaring sunlight. Okay, again, he said that our eyes are a very important part of our body part because, okay, so when uh, we are we are not allowed to uh, um, to look at directly to the sun because it will damage our eyes. So, in other days, reading is a very uh, reading in a very bright or very dim area will cause eye strain. Our eyes get tired easily. We should read in an area with a proper brightness. We can use lamps to improve the brightness of an area in order to read comfortably. Okay, so sometimes when we are reading in a bright or dim area, it's not good because it can cause our eyes strain, or in other words, it can get tired easily. So some people, when they are studying their lesson at home, they have a long, a long to improve the brightness of an area in order to read or convenient them to read the lessons. Okay, so let me say the next is okay. Example. Okay, these are the examples on how we use this in our okay. Next. How about watching television in a dark will also cause an eye strain? Okay, so so when we are uh, watching TV at home, we should turn on some lights in order uh, it it minimizes the light radiations uh, from the television direct to our eyes. Okay, so this is the cause eye strains. Therefore, we should. We should watch television in an area with a proper brightness. Okay, because some of our mother or father, everyone, uh, when we are watching TV, they want us to turn off, uh, turn off the lights. You know, it says that it can save energy, but it's not good. We must turn on either one ball of light so that it can minimize the rotation of television directly to our eyes. So. We must avoid using digital devices like cell phones and tablets in the dark. Okay, the surrounding area should be bright as the brightness of the screen of the device. Okay, this is a set of examples on people doing. Okay, 
at home. So the first one means X, which are uh, too dark, means X, we don't, uh, we don't do this like this because the radiations on the telephone, it uh, directly comes to our eyes. So too dark as well. Too dark means X, we do not allow. Okay, like this. Number three is using digital device. Okay, is it correct? Have some little brightness. Okay, so this one is okay. Okay, check. Okay, we have some a little brightness when we are using our tablets or a computer desk, a telephone at home. Okay, the first one, too dark, too dark means it's not good. So we have a little light, lights on. Do this is okay. So, next. When we say dim, with the word eye strain, okay, with the word eye strain. Okay, the word eye strain is a common condition. Okay, it's a common condition that of course when your eyes is getting tired. Eye strain is a common is a common condition. It's a common condition that of course When your eyes is getting tired. Sorry. Okay, the word eye strain. Eye strain. Okay, eye strain is a common condition that of course when your eyes is getting tired. Tired. Okay, sorry. Okay. Next, how about glaring? Okay, this second word I think it is a, a difficult word. Okay, the word glaring is reflecting a strong or something. Okay, is reflecting. Exposing on the computer, notebook, telephone, television, okay, your eyes will get strained. Glaring, or we can say it is reflecting a strong for something. Okay. Next. Okay, this word, okay, this word, uh, Answer your uh, textbook on page 88. 88. Okay, there are some vocabulary that are uh, written here. So, we need to wait to do is to answer. Fill in the blank. Write the correct answer on the page provided, in the space provided. Okay, example. I will read first. The first word is sun, reflected, natural, proper, light bulb, dim. Straight, eye damage, all artificial, non luminous. Okay, so this is served as your. Okay, this is a short your homework or worksheet. Please answer your textbook on page 88. And then um, next week, I will give you a short spelling test about that. Uh, about the vocabulary I have shown to you a while ago. Okay, we have 10 vocabulary, so we have a short, a short spelling test next week. Okay, this is 
for now. Goodbye. Okay. Thank you.